Today we are going to get introduced to standard form and we're going to convert it to slope intercept form. So somebody was looking at slope intercept form and point slope form and they're like, wouldn't it be a great idea just to put all the x's and the y's on one side and the integer on the other to get this actually kind of pointless equation. You can only do something with it if you convert it to slope intercept form. All right, so a reminder, slope intercept form is y equals mx plus b. So we need to get y by itself. So I'm going to draw railroad tracks here. If we want y by itself, we have to get rid of the x's. So I'm going to minus 5x from both sides. All right, so over here on the left, 5x minus 5x is 0, which is nothing, so I don't need it anymore. But I still have 2y. On the right, I cannot combine 6 and negative 5x because they are not like terms. So I'm going to write them side by side, but I'm going to put the x term first um, because y equals mx plus b, so I want the x term first. All right, then 2y means 2 times y, so I'm going to divide by 2, and I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. 2 divided by 2 is 1. 1y is the same as just y. Over here, we have to divide both of the terms by 2. I like to draw a heart, saying I'm going to divide this part, and I'm going to divide this part. So negative 5 divided by 2, we're going to just keep that as a fraction. Negative 5 over 2x, and then 6 divided by 2 is 3, so plus 3. So y equals negative 5 half x plus 3. All right, let's try another. x minus 4y equals 12. And again, this is called standard form because the x's and the y's are all on one side of the equal sign. And then the integer is on the other side. Okay, so we have to get rid of that x. This minus 4y, that negative belongs to the 4, not to the x. The x is positive. So to get rid of the x, we have to subtract it. I forgot my railroad tracks there. So x minus x is 0 or nothing. Bring down negative 4y. And then 12 minus x. I can't combine them because they are not like terms. So I'm going to write them side by side. I'm going to put the x term first. All right, so then um, negative 4y, that's multiplication. So I'm going to divide by negative 4. All right, negative 4 divided by negative 4 is 1. 1y one is just y. We divide here. There is an implied 1 right here. So it's negative 1 divided by negative 4. Negative divided by negative is positive. But we'll have to keep that fraction of 1 fourth. And then 12 divided by negative 4 is negative 3. So that is our new equation in slope-intercept form.